सो एवरी वन दिस इज श्रेयस राज फंडी और एपेटिक्स की आई टूडे आई टेली हाउ टू गेट इंडियन आउट बाउंड नंबर्स बिकॉज इट्स बिन अ बिगेस्ट रोड ब्लॉक फॉर मी एंड माई एजेंसी बट वी आर फाइनली फिगर इट आउट ऑल्सो इफ यू वॉन्ट ए ऑटोमेशन सर्विस फॉर फॉर बिजनेस टू डू बुक अ कंसल्टेशन कॉल अगेन इट्स ऑल फॉर यू आई टेल यू हाउ टू गेट इंडियन आउट बाउंड नंबर्स दिस इज बिन द बिगेस्ट क्वेश्चन आई थिंक दिस इज गॉन विद द फर्स्ट वीडियो वेर आई सिंपली रिवील it's not going to be like you know i'm not going to try to stretch this for like 10 minutes or something i mean yeah it, it might be almost 10 minutes but i'll be super quick super to the point okay so again uh, first of all so to canva so there's this platform called viva digitally so they these guys they provide you outbound numbers for you know ai calling and stuff integrates with directly wapi and allows you to do outbound calls which is super cool in the end so what do you need for this so you need a gst now this doesn't has to be your own gst you can ask your friends gst anyone that has a gst certificate you need that that's the minimum that's the bare minimum that you need once you have a gst certificate you need 30 grands 30000 indian rupees 20000 indian rupees to buy the number okay so you have to buy these number so the line i'll tell you the cost breakdown real quick so we got 1000 rupees per number per month per number and this is this is this is, this is per month it's going to be n o per month this 1000 rupees per number per month okay and for the first month there's a lock in period there's a 3 month lock in period which means that you need to buy it for 3 months so assuming that if you buy one phone number it's going to cost you almost 3000 dollars 3000 rupees because you know uh, there's this lock in period you cannot buy for less than this time you need to buy for buy it for at least 3 months okay so assuming you buy one number okay one number and there is a minimum balance you need to have a minimum balance into your uh, viva digitally account so for the outbound calling the rates are 50 paise 55 paise per minute so assuming that Uh, you will need at least ten thousand rupees worth of balance in your account to actually proceed with this. So I have again I I have it I have this much. Uh, so I have like this much account in my balance. So this is a minimum. So in total you will need an investment of almost thirteen thousand rupees to get an Indian outbound phone number, which you could use for cold calling, telemarketing, any purpose that you want, even for demos. You can use it for all of that. This is going to be the basic game. Number one, okay, your your GST and stuff. Now, how do you sign up for this? Okay, so I'll first show you how I how did I sign up for it. So I'll quickly go to 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 yeah. I'll go to mail dot hostinger. I'll show you the emails that I got my email conversation with the team. So first, you simply go to their website website Viva Digitally. <coughs> so you go in here. I'll also show you the con complete conversation I had with the representative. Get the rep. So I'll quickly go in here. Go to WhatsApp. Search for um, Viva. So yeah. So again, you simply just got to call them, give them, drop them a ring. That's what I did. So yeah. These are all the stuff that they ask you for. Just simply give them the registration number, etc., etc. I gave them all of this right here. Five dates pack plan. I reduced it to like yeah, it's still five dates if I if I remember. Works. So here's it. Scroll down. Uh, GST certificate. So what happened was that later on I gave them. Uh, so I had two GST certificates. I have one for Maharashtra and one from Bihar. So I gave them the Bihar uh, GST certificate. They simply denied me. They said we can't. You know we cannot allow that. I should that as well. Yeah. Uh, so, so, so then they give you two forms. One is called CAF and one is a service agreement. Fill out both the forms and you'll be good to go. As mentioned, they they only service Maharashtra, Karnataka, and Tamil Nadu, and they only provide in these regions. They cannot provide service. So if you are in I don't know UP, if you are in Bihar, if you are in anywhere else, if you are in Delhi, wherever you are, you will not get their number. As simple as that. You need to be, you need to be in you know. in either of these regions it it could be the maharashtra karnataka tamil nadu any of these to get the phone number now how to obtain the phone number go on the website uh yeah go on the website scroll down and just call them so there's this i what that's what i did 
I just called them and I was like, hey, I want it. And they're like, okay, perfect. Just grab the number. It could be India. Grab this number. Call them. Tell them that, hey, you know, we want the number, blah, blah. And they'll give you, like, they'll uh, give you the, they'll do the further processing. So, I'll just quickly log into my company account. This is the most transparent, you know, demonstration of how to get these Indian numbers. I'm not going to roll around because I know, you know, we got more important things to do in life. So I'm just going to show you how it went. It's Viva. It's Viva communication. So I'll go for Viva. I'll also tell you how to set up these numbers because not everyone is telling you this. So I'll also tell you that. Okay. Okay. What the hell? Look, this is weird. Okay, th th this must be some warm up, warm up. Yeah. Anyways, so once you, uh, once you pay or once you do the payment and stuff, so they'll they'll give you, they send you something like this. So there's Viva communication. Here's the order. So payment failed. So two times the payment failed. Finally, the payment went through. Paid via digital communications. Blah blah blah. Should we a project brief? Viva. Okay. Yeah. So they just, they'll just drop your plan detail and the proposal. You just you get that. Fill out the CAF agreement and fill out the service agreement. Again, it's not, you just do a signature. Uh, it's super quick, super easy. <clears throat> and you'll have, the, you'll have the phone numbers. And this is how you'll receive these phone numbers. So you'll receive the phone numbers in this, in this particular format, okay? Now you have, assuming that you are watching this video and you have your phone numbers, you have did the payment, you had, now you have the phone numbers, okay? How do you import this into WAPI? Now, I only know for WAPI. If you want to do it for real detail and stuff, there's Life Kit. You need to do it via Life Kit, but I use WAPI. I personally have an inclination towards WAPI. So, how do you do it in WAPI? Well, I'll show you real quick that as well. Go to Viva. Sorry, go to WAPI. Go to WAPI AI. Click on Open Dashboard. Once you're in here, I'll just quickly yeah, sign into your account. Just simply sign into your account and there would be an option. So I'll quickly sign in real quick. So now close some of these. So once you're in here, go to, there has to be an option on credentials. You have to go into credentials or something. So sessions, I think it's in settings or something. Yeah, go into integrations, my bad. Go into integrations. Scroll down. This is the settings, okay? View details. So this is the setting that you guys need to do, okay? You can just screenshot this or whatever. Just just do these settings. Now, just to show you how it works, I'll, I'll connect one of my SIP trunks again. So I'm assuming I did for one, right? Uh, yeah, we are phone one dot com. I did for like 9893. So I did it for the 893 one, which is this one. Let me just do it for this one, account ID, this is the one, okay? Go in here, username is this. Password is this. I'm gonna blur it out because I know that. <laughs> I cannot be showing them, showing this all around, but that's about it. Grab the domain, which is Viva Phone one So put it in the under the getaway getaway domain. It's going, you can just put it in the IP address and all that kind of stuff. Put it under under there. So it's Viva Phone One. Allow inbound. Just 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 deselect one of this. So allow inbound. Add another gateway. So this gateway has to be this IP address. Copy this. Paste it here. Say and now now make this outbound only. Okay. We got all of this. So this trunk is just set up. Now if I click on save SIP trunk. A name is required, right? I'll say Viva. What's the number? Eight nine four two. Viva nine four two. Click on save zip trunk. It's gonna be saved in a while. There's a slight error. Let me check what it is. 
domain address is all good o option is disabled okay viva phone one the ip is the same this is the username this is the password do i use the registration no i don't this password is gonna be did i paste the wrong password save zip trunk fail to fetch okay that's weird It's taking a while. Save sip trunk. It's weird anyways if uh, I already have this one saved saved in here which is good if I go under phone numbers now click on create a phone number click on bring your own sip grab the sip trunk which is which I already have here grab this phone number this is a date right I'll grab this one paste it here get plus nine one Viva two Click on import SIP phone number. Let's just make an outbound call now using this. So the phone number assistant would be this one. Squad would be this no, no. Oh shit, my bad. It should be this one. So we care hair salon plus nine one nine three zero seven five one two eight one six. Click on make a call. It's working. Let's go. From we care home salon. How may I help you? I want to book a, a haircut, probably. Okay. Sure. Are you um calling from Bangalore or Ranchi today? It's working, folks. This is how we do it. Simple, straightforward. But if you again, if you are a business owner, don't go around doing this because you know there are a lot of technical difficulties and stuff. It's not. You know, it doesn't end here. A lot of technical stuffs involved and st all the kind of things. So. What you could do is book a consultation call right below this, you know, because I don't want you to get, do all of these things yourself because, again, it can get increasingly complex, you know. Uh, connecting the phone numbers is the only thing. You have to take care of the concurrency limits. I cannot start blasting calls with this number. I need to do a lot of things before I do that. So I have all of that things to do. But, yeah, I mean, you know, uh, it's, it's sometimes, sometimes it's best to leave things to the experts. So if you want a consultation call, Please feel free to book it down below. I'll be per personally be there and you know uh, help you with your business. If you want AI automation services, just drop a consultation call. If you want my AI automation course where you learn how to start and scale a complete AI automation agency and make a hell lot of money, uh, it's uh, go on educatexai.com. And anyways, if you found this video helpful, like, subscribe, share. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next one.